Time once again for Let's Eat, brought to you by the Kitchen Collection, as well as Events with Taste, right down here on Broad Street at 2440 Broad. My friend Michelle Wells is here, and Michelle, we have Father's Day coming up. Who doesn't love a good, hearty steak for Father's Day? So we're gonna marinate this one. You could do it the day before, right. if you wanted. Um, and this whole recipe is going to be the grilled flank steak with a Bloody Mary salad. Mm -hmm. So a lot of the ingredients that are going in it are the things you're going to think of in a Bloody Mary. Yeah. So we're going to marinate it with a little balsamic. Right. Some salt and pepper. Salt and pepper. Chili powder. Oh, yeah. Brown sugar. Brown sugar. Thanks. And? Smoked paprika. Smoked paprika. And we're just going to squish it all together. You kind of do it you like this? You could do this, yeah, the day before. Right. Um, and oh, let yeah. it, just let it sort of. Let all those flavors get acquainted. Absolutely. And I also chose flank steak because dad does a lot of the grilling. Mm -hmm. So now maybe mom's going to grill or the kids are going to grill. Flank steak is a lot more forgiving on a grill. It's right. not going to cook as quickly as a ribeye or sure. a tenderloin. So I would say for a piece like that, you're going to be four minutes, four to five minutes per side for medium rare to medium. That's perfect. All right, what do we have next? And we're going to make with it a grilled potato salad. So I have pre-grilled these. Right. You could do them on your charcoal grill with a grill pan. Mm -hmm. Or if you have the ever popular Blackstone griddles, you could do it yeah. on that. Um, just salt and pepper, a little bit of oil. Right. And then into it, we're going to add some carrots just for color. And for health. Carrots are good right. for you. Um, some green onion. Green onions are good for you. A little bit of bacon. Bacon is even better for you. After all, it is Father's Day, right? And then some whole gray mustard. Oh, yeah. A little bit of garlic. A little bit of garlic, which cleanses the blood. Fresh parsley. Check. A little wow. bit of extra virgin olive oil. You make this look so easy. And some red wine vinegar. A or sherry red vinegar. Wine vinegar or sherry vinegar. We have both at the store. Yes, you do. And by the way, if you haven't been into the kitchen collection yet, you are missing out. You still have time to go down and get Dad a Father's Day gift certificate at the kitchen collection at 2440 Broad Street. All and right. we have tons of grill supplies there. They have got darn near everything that you could imagine. And a few things you probably can't, but it's really cool. That is one beautiful salad. And then to go with our steak, sort mm -hmm. of our sauce for the steak, right? our Bloody Mary salad, we have some cherry tomatoes that we've halved. We have some celery, including the leaves. The leaves have the most flavor, believe right. it or not. So that, now if I was making this at home, I wouldn't put any olives in it. Consider this your home away from home. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna let y'all have some olives, All right. but um, mm -mm. There you go. A little bit of the brine. Check. Now think about Bloody Mary. We've got horseradish. Mm -hmm. That's a lot of horseradish. <laughs> <laughs> some Worcestershire. Right. And a little bit of red wine vinegar. A little bit of red wine vinegar. Some Tabasco. Oh yeah. Celery seed. Check. And then some red onions that I've macerated in the red wine vinegar. Right. Um, it just makes them not so pungent. Yeah. All right. They take over the salad. Once all that is in, mix it all up. Mix it all up. Do you want to do some TV magic? I would love to. I am going to whip out this steak, or its twin, that Michelle has perfectly grilled, as she said, four to five minutes aside for medium to medium rare. Right? That is absolutely beautiful. And then I feel like we can just sort of plate our salad. Well, not everybody's got one of these fancy boards that they can put a steak and a salad on, Michelle, but you do at the Kitchen Collection. We most certainly do. We and these are made by do. a local woodworker, mm -hmm. uh, CW Woodworking. Right. Um, yeah, Absolutely. So. And we're the beautiful. only retail store that carries them. You're the only retail store that carries a lot of the really cool stuff. Doesn't matter if it's your dad or your mom, you, your wife, your significant other, somebody that lives three states away. They will love something from the Kitchen Collection at 2440 Broad Street. So this is a chocolate cobbler. So you got think, a big spoon? I, I we're can, we're going to go with this one. Okay. Go. This is a chocolate Chocolate cobbler. cobbler. So think wow. chocolate lava cake, yeah. but, but easy. So everybody gets nervous to make right. the lava cakes and mm -hmm. how do you cook them? How do much do you more? cook them? So this is, see? Oh, yeah. A little Look bit of that. lava. Look at that. That is a work of art. And then 
simple. You have a little easy. gelato, is that correct? Yes, this is milk and honey gelato. So top the chocolate cover, chocolate cobbler with ice cream. Holy cow, you Who can make a meal that? in and of itself. 2440 Broad Street, right now from our studios, your website is? Kitchen-collection.com. I don't know about you, but I'm hungry with all this. Are you ready? Let's eat.